Oh goodness, it's been such a long time since I've recorded a video. Oh my god, that's crazy. Okay, anyways, welcome back to my channel. Um, we're just gonna get ready. Um, I just primed my face, I just got out of the shower. I also found in Walmart last night Milani Conceal and Perfect 2-in-1 Foundation and Concealer. I got the shade Medium Beige. And I also found Wet n Wild. Walmart has stuffed up their game. I have been looking for this foundation everywhere. I went to two CVSs, a Walmart, another Walmart, a Kroger. I've went basically everywhere you can think of that in Virginia has that's not like almost towards North Carolina to look for this. Because I'm not driving all the way to North Carolina for a foundation. But I finally found it. Finally. Fingers crossed it works. Actually, I know it works because I've been wearing this for the past two days, but I just haven't vi made a video on it yet. And I'm not making a video on it right now. It's going to be tomorrow. Sorry, chickens. Today, we're going to be doing the Milani Conceal and Perfect 2-in-1 Foundation. It says, medium to full coverage, lightweight, oil-free formula, long-wearing, water-resistant, and sweat-proof. Which, if you take the job that I do, which is a MedTech and a CNA, and the rooms are, like, a hundred and some degrees because, well, to them it's it's nice and warm, but to us, we're like, <clears throat> help us need water. Like Spongebob, you know, when he's not in water, you know, kind of, that's kind of how I feel sometimes. I don't know. Anyways, we're going to really try this out today. Anyways, I just washed, primed my face. I got something in my eyeball other than my eyes. And also through Wet n Wild while I am talking, I'm just kind of scatterbrained right now, but it's okay. I found... These, which are their matte lipsticks. This one is Give Me Mocha. And it's beautiful. It's got a little doe foot applicator. And I'll show you in this one. This one is Nudist Peach. Do you see that little doe foot? Like, that is, like, legit. And this was $4.68. That's not bad at all. Like, what the hell? And this is another doe foot. This one is called Coral Corruption. And I'm actually going to be kind of doing a wear test on these. I have one, but it kind of makes my lips brown looking, and I don't really like it. But I also swatched them on my hand last night when I bought them because I went to Walmart. And they're still very much visibly there. Like, they don't come off. I mean, they do, but I mean, that's a good lipstick for... Five dollars almost that stays where you put it. I love that. I'm happy. Like that's anyone's dream, especially for me. Cause if you're like me and you're always talking or doing something and you know you do that to your lip or something and it doesn't come off, that's what you want. Four dollars and sixty eight cents, you cannot beat that. Alright, we're just gonna get into this video now because I'm rambling. I got my real technique sponge and I got the one from Sephora. They're both damp. Love them damp. And we're just gonna pump, and it's got a pump. The Wet n Wild one does not, but I don't really, it doesn't bother me because it has a nice little spatula thingy to it. And I got, this is in the shade Medium Beige. They actually have a really good um, shade selection, I think, personally, because it goes from like, I can't remember the dark, the fairest shade, but I mean, I always fall right in between to a medium beige or a light to medium beige. So I kind of fall right in between. I don't know. If you're a pale princess, that's okay. Because I'm pretty sure they have one for you somewhere. I know what Wild does. I think there's his ivory. And I think this one actually might have porcelain. It might. Unless I looked at a different foundation. Don't quote me on that though. But I mean, they sell this foundation. I've heard so many good things about it. So I'm really excited. And I'm just going to... Start putting this on my face. I might be okay with this shade. This shade might actually work out really well. I was debating last night between getting this one and another one. And I was like, well, if I get this one and it doesn't work, I can always return it. But so far, it actually looks really nice. Um, uh, I actually really like this. This is actually really pretty. It's thick, but it's not like... um. Cakey. There's no smell. Um, I'm not gonna actually do concealer. 
or anything special with my makeup tonight. Oh, uh, today. I'm going to work, so. And I'm just going to kind of, you know, put a little, do the foundation. Um, I'm going to do some wear tests, throw it, final thoughts and stuff like that, you know. Um, this is actually really, really nice. Um, I have a little acne it's not even acne. It's just like a pimple on my chin. And I pop it and it comes back. And I'm like, could you please not? Like, can you just go away? Like, could you please? Anyways, um, while I'm just applying this, I'm going to ramble. Um, if you're new to my channel, my name's Colin. Um, if you like my videos, please like and subscribe to my channel. Leave comments of anything that you would like to see. I'll do it. I'm pretty much... A very willing person to do anything. That sounds really bad. Um, on certain, with certain circumstances, it depends on what you want me to do. Let's talk about, let, let's just leave it into the category of makeup. Because I'm not doing all them crazy shit some people want me to do. I'm too pretty for all that. This is actually really nice coverage. Like, this is really pretty. Um, I don't have my normal mirror with me, so I'm gonna use my broader bronzer mirror right here just to kinda look at it up close. Ooh, pretty. Oh, that's nice. Oh my goodness. Ooh, if this stays on all day like it's it claims, then yo, like I'm I'm happy. I like this. Um, after <clears throat> excuse me, I have the plague. <clears throat> I really do. I have plague. Like I don't know. Anyways, after I'm done applying all my makeup, well, the foundation, I should say, I'm gonna kind of bring you in a little closer. And just so you can see my face, um, I'm going to do my neck real quick. Um, this shade might be like a hair darker than my actual skin. But, um, it's, it, I don't know. I actually think it actually works really well. The only reason I didn't get the other one that they had in front of this one was because it actually was very pale looking. And I'm not really a pale princess. I'm more of like Jasmine off of Aladdin, even though I want to be Ariel. But I mean, like, I guess that's okay too, because Jasmine was pretty. Like, I'm more like Jasmine's skin tone off of Aladdin, you know? Unfortunately, I'm not a pale princess, which if I was a pale princess, I don't know. I just feel like I wouldn't look right. But I don't know. I'm beautiful. Everybody's beautiful in their own way. Holla. Okay, so I'm just gonna make, like, a first um, first comment, like, on this foundation right now. It, it's fucking beautiful. Like, I'm sorry. It is fucking beautiful. Like, I feel like I'm not... I don't need to conceal. I feel like if I wanted to, I easily could. But I'm not going to. Because it says it's a built-in concealer with it. You know what this kind of reminds me of? It kind of reminds me of... Not the formula of it, but, like, the built-in concealer with it. Except for this is a two-in-one. Um, there's one through CoverGirl, and it's CoverGirl Outlast, I think. And it has, like, a concealer in it, the foundation, and some other one in it. And it's, like, a three-in-one. If you know what I'm talking about, please leave the name down below, because I cannot remember it to save my life. I used it before, and I actually really don't care for that foundation. I think it's beautiful on some people, but for me, I do not like it personally. I'm not bashing CoverGirl, because CoverGirl has some of the best things. Actually, How can I bash CoverGirl? Because I actually have CoverGirl products over here on my counter somewhere. I use CoverGirl blush. I've used their concealer. I've used their mascara. They have wonderful shit. I'm not bashing it. I don't like their foundations on my skin, though, because I'm so oily. Um... I just personally feel like they don't stay very well. But, I mean, that doesn't mean I'm not ever going to give CoverGirl another shot. Maybe I just haven't found the one. I've used several different CoverGirls. My mom, on the other hand, has no nice and normal, like, no dry skin or anything. 
And my mom can wear um, CoverGirl foundation just fine. For me, mm, it's, it's another story. It's Oompa Loompa time, honey. Oompa Loompa time. We don't got time for that. So, I'm going to bring you in a little closer to my face. This is my face. Hi, guys. Like, do you see that coverage? Look at that. That is so f beautiful. Like, oh, my God. Like, in person, this looks a lot better. Uh, everything looks better in person. I'm sorry. The camera doesn't do justice for this foundation. But I'm very happy. Like, this did so much better than I expected. I was so nervous. I've heard such good things. And I was so nervous, but I'm so glad I taught, I was like, in my head, I'm, I'm always debating. I'm like, should I do it? Should I not? Should I do it? Should I not? Should I do it? Should I not? And I was like, you know what? I'm just going to buy it. If it doesn't work, I can return it. It worked. It definitely worked. I don't have to conceal. I'm going to, though. Just to kind of brighten my under eyes up a little. Um, just because I do have some circles, because... Um, this is like my ninth day straight. Um, I haven't had a day off and I am so excited because I have Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday off. I'm so excited. Like, I am ready for a four-day weekend. I haven't had one of them in, oh God, I haven't had one of them in a long, long time. Normally, I have to request for them, but they were like, well, you've picked up so much overtime. Let's give you some days off. And I'm like, thank you. I get sleep. I'm gonna look like a normal person again. And, um, my concealer is NARS through, up uh, through NARS. It's NARS and it's creamy vanilla. I actually personally really love, love, love this concealer. Um, it's just so beautiful. It, it makes your under eyes so much brighter. Um. It's nice. It's thick. It's creamy. It's, I like the consistency of it. I'm not going down. I'm running low on, on the concealer, actually, and I'm actually burning up right now. Whew! Hot. Anyone else get hot when they get right out of the shower and, like, try and get ready? And they're like... <sighs> I feel like a dog that's been outside all day. So, there's my face again. This foundation is beautiful. Like, if you have any doubts about it, don't. Just buy it. You'll love it. Like, I mean, it's pretty, it's, it's so, it's just pretty. I love it. I'm so happy as I knock it over and throw it against my mirror. But that's okay. Um, I'm going to do my eyes real quick. I'm going to actually use the, I don't want to use the Voluminous Feline. I'm going to use the Colossal Big Shot. And this is through Maybelline. Oh, and while I was in Walmart, I found this. And it's called Hard Candy. And it's a plumping serum volumizing lip gloss and it's just a clear tube it's really pretty and it actually doesn't some lip plumpers i've noticed like burn the shit out of your lips and you feel like you're like have fire on your mouth that one doesn't but i mean i notice like when i put it on my lips because i don't have big lips anyways unfortunately i have a little bird lips i don't know i like them i think they're pretty they fall with my face whatever don't judge my lips because you don't know these lips Anyways, that stuff works really good. It's very, it's, it's sticky at first, but it does dry. I wouldn't say it dries matte, but I mean, it dries and it's very nice. It smells, it doesn't really have a smell. I mean, it kind of smells like chemicals because that's what lip plumper is. Actually, that's what like all of these are. Anything that you put on your lips is chemical. Now, some of them do smell like creamsicle and ice cream and vanilla, but Unfortunately, this does not. Anyways, I'm going to shut up and put on my eyes real quick. Um, once again, if you would like to see any videos, link them down, comment down below, like, subscribe, watch my videos, or I'll have to haunt you. Oh, goodness, my mascara is not applying very well today. Oh, no. Oh, no, this is, I might have a, this, I, I need to get a new one. Oh, no. Oh, boy. So, we might not actually be applying a lot, quite a, oh dear, oh dear goodness, they're all clumpy together, oh no, oh dear. Okay, we're not going to use this one on the other eye, we're just going to try this one and, oh, I'm throwing everything in the floor. Ah, uh, ow, sorry about that, I like threw all my wet and wild lipsticks on the floor. 
So I'm kind of really testing this foundation on its own. Oh, by the way, the concealer blended out really nice with it. That's a good thing. Products that play together, stay together. Um, I'm just going to put a little powder under my eyes. And whatever's left on the brush, I'm just going to kind of dust on my face. But I'm really testing this foundation because of the claims that are on the bottle. Medium to full coverage. I definitely agree with that. Lightweight, oil-free formula, long-wearing, water-resistant, and sweat-proof. This is what I need. This is what... If those claims match up to what it's saying it's going to do, that's good. Like, that's what someone needs. Like, if you're going out... To a party during the summer if you're just going out to run errands or if you're just going to work like me you know that's what you need you need a good nice foundation that's gonna stay sorry i concentrate so hard when i'm doing my eyes because i don't want to poke myself in the eyeball i don't have time for that So, did anybody look at the solar eclipse? Like, if you looked at the solar eclipse, please share, like, some of your photos and comments with me, like, on what you saw. Um, I actually got to look at it, but I was actually at work. So, I was more... I really... I only got to look at it, like, two times, and... I really was kind of leery about the whole glasses thing, because, you know, they say it's such a powerful... The light on it is so blinding, it can actually cause blindness and I was so I'm sorry but like I was too scared I don't want to lose my eyesight I'm 22 years old I can't I don't want to lose my eyesight you know um but I mean I, from what I did see it was very very pretty I was very much um it, it was very pretty I was very impressed because I actually was one of those people that was not giving it all like giving it all this hype I can't help it I'm sorry I was like well I mean uh, how did we know it was going to be that good? What if it won't? Then we all, like, all hyped up for nothing. And, you know, I was kind of like, okay, well, maybe it's going to be good. Maybe it's not. So, we'll see. I was wrong. I was wrong. It was very pretty. Very pretty. Um, I got a little bit of my L'Oreal Hydro Perfect powder on my damp beauty blender right here. I'm just going to kind of put under my eye. I'm not baking. I'm just kind of setting my under eyes because I don't want to sit the rest of my face. So... I figure if I don't use my Real Technique sponge, then I won't have to dust my face because I'm not going to. I don't want to dust my face. Um, the only reason I don't want to dust my face is because I don't. I want to see this foundation on its own. Because even with the powder, it, it might do really good with the powder. But actually what I am going to do is, this is uh, one of those bamboo natural brushes that my mom got me from Walmart. She didn't get them for me. She got them for herself, but didn't like it. Thanks, Mom. I'm just going to kind of... Just kind of make sure everything moves around. Uh, I got a hair on my face. Help. I need tweezers. Uh -oh. I got it. Just so in case I messed up anything. <clears throat> Why not? What's it gonna hurt? Oh, let me sit back off. Ah, I feel like there's another hair on my face. Anyways, so this is the foundation. It has I have no powder on. It's actually a lot prettier in person. Like it's actually very full coverage. Do you see that on my neck? I don't look right on my nose. Like the color actually is really nice. Excuse me. Alright. 
Well, I'm going to get off of here now and put on some lipstick. Yeah, I don't want I don't want y'all to see the lipstick cuz I'm going to it's a surprise. All right. Well, if you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe to my channel. Um if you want to see any videos, link them down below, comment nice things. Um Yeah, just I hope you enjoyed. I'll see you tomorrow actually. Bye.